Tony came to major in composition and he was, he had a drive that was quite atypical. There's no question that Tony came with a passion for music. He was passionate about it and especially for new music. He was one of the first students I had here who was really, really excited about doing conducting work. He, he took that proverbial bull by the horns and really ran with it. He led our college orchestra here and one of the first LBC students to perform internationally with the LBC Symphony Orchestra. Every oral aspect of the world was material for Tony's music. He really wanted to do some much higher level work and he did it. And then now to actually see him out there as a, a really accomplished faculty colleague is a, is a rare treat. He has this intensity about it, about what he's doing. He's very earnest, very sincere. He was a complete joy to work with. Not the best possible kind of relationship between a teacher and a student is that both of them learn from each other. And I think that happened. He's really good at what he does. And it's interesting, it's intriguing. And I think he has found a way to really make a name for himself in that, that realm of composition and make really fascinating pieces that clearly are, are finding an audience. And he's been all over the world presenting his research work on that. He was, as I said, passionate about music, especially new music. He created sounds electronically. He recorded sounds. He wrote music, which would be played acoustically on acoustic instruments. And it's, of course, immensely inventive and fascinating and not at all what you might expect. I am immensely proud of what you've done. I have every hope and expectation that you will really prove to be an inspiration for our current students and the students who are yet to come through our doors. I would also want him to know that I genuinely believe it's the right thing that it happened in the way it did, that he made it happen. It took a lot of work, but he's a brilliant young man and doing what he should be doing, what he always knew he should be doing.